We have two issues here, Brenda. First, those overpayments. Are you responsible if it wasn't your mistake? You filled out the forms and the state sent a check. How would you know if it wasn't right? Second, why is the department still taking so long to process unemployment claims? So right now, things are really going well. That depends on who you ask. Alabama Labor Secretary Fitzgerald Washington touting record unemployment. But things are not going so well for those filing for unemployment, filing appeals or waivers, waiting months and months. We still have people who uh, like applied for benefits or never got notices and like there's just nothing happening two years later. Legal Services Alabama's Mike Fortin says the nonprofit is representing 20 plaintiffs. There were unprecedented claims during the pandemic, but the department can't seem to catch up even now. And when you're unemployed, delays can have devastating consequences. Labor Secretary Washington would not answer our questions, citing those pending lawsuits. A written statement reads in part, ADOL currently waives over payments in the case of agents or employer error and offers payment plans to those claimants with overpayments that are not waived. The department is currently looking whether to expand the use of allowed waivers. They claim that you can ask for a waiver. They just never grant them. The governor's office says it was not consulted on this matter. Governor Ivey's position, if a mistake is made by the government, people should not have to pay the price for something that was no fault of their own. We have asked Secretary Washington to provide us with solutions to resolve this concerning situation, as well as the outrageous backlog. Numbers from the federal government show Alabama paid out $623 million in unemployment claims in the third quarter of 2020 to second quarter 2021. The overpayment rate was 23.658 percent, totaling $147 million. Other states facing similar struggles, Florida, Tennessee, and Virginia, all over 40 percent in their overpayment rates. Several states now moving to waive those overpayments. If you do get a notice from the Department of Labor, Attorney Fortin advises you ask for one of those waivers. You can always file an appeal and Legal Services Alabama can help no charge.